Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more news and latest Canadian immigration updates by Blue Eye Immigration. Hello everyone today's we are talking about IRCC new and latest processing time 2023. These processing timelines are given to provide applicants for visas or immigration to Canada an idea of how long it would take to complete their applications. Additionally, potential applicants who desire to submit an application for a Canadian immigration or visa can acquire a feel of what to anticipate before doing so. These processing durations are provided so that candidates for Canadian immigration and visas can obtain a rough indication of the status of their applications. Based on data gathered over the last six months, these processing times are intended to provide new weekly processing times. Furthermore, the processing period starts when the application is received by IRCC and concludes when the immigration officer makes a determination about the application. Let us first tell you about IRCC processing times for citizenship and PR cards, there have been no changes since last week, in the processing period. For citizenship grants, which is now 22 months, the processing period for citizenship certificates, which serve as proof of citizenship, is now 11 months, and there have been no recent adjustments. The current processing period for resuming citizenship is 30 months, and there have been no changes since last week, for renunciation of citizenship, the current processing time is 14 months, and there have been no changes since last week. For search of citizenship records, the current processing time is 15 months, and there have been no changes since last week, for new PR card, the current processing time is 70 days. And for PR card renewals, the current processing time is 36 days. Now. Moving on IRCC processing time for family sponsorship for spouse or common law partner living outside Canada, the current processing time is 16 months and for spouse or common law partner living inside Canada, the current processing time is 14 months. And for parents or grandparents PR, the current processing time is 25 months and have been no changes since last week. Next is processing time for Canadian passport for in Canada new passport regular application submitted in person at Service Canada Centre passport services it takes 10 business days to process, and for in Canada new passport regular application submitted by mail to Service Canada Centre it takes 20 business days to process, and there have been no changes in the processing time since last week, for in Canada urgent pickup, it takes 1 business day days to process, and for in Canada express. Pickup, it takes two nine business days to process. Now let us tell you about the processing time for economic class for Canadian Experience Class CEC, it takes four months to process and for Federal Skilled Worker Program FSWP, it takes 26 months to process, for Federal Skilled Trades Program FSTP, it takes not enough data. Next for Provincial Nominee Program PNP via Experts Entry it takes 10 months to process. For non-express entry PNP, it takes 19 months to process, for Quebec skilled workers QSW it takes 21 months, and for Quebec business class, it takes 68 months to process, and there have been no changes in the processing time since last week, for federal self-employed, it takes 46 months to process, and there have been no changes in the processing time since last week. For Atlantic Immigration Pilot IPE, it takes 30 months to process, and there have been no changes in the processing time since last week, and for startup visa, it takes 36 months to process, and there have been no changes in the processing time since last week. Finally, let us tell you about the processing time for temporary residence application. First, for visitor visa outside Canada, it varies country by country, now, for visitor visa inside Canada. For online, it takes 10 days to process, and for paper-based, it takes 27 days. And moving on parents or grandparents super visa it also varies by country, now coming on visitor extension visitor record for online applications, the processing time is 164 days, for paper-based applications, the processing time is 110 days. Now, for study permit outside Canada. The processing time is 7 weeks, for study permit inside Canada, the processing time is 3 weeks, moving on study permit extension for online applications, 
the processing time is 85 days, for paper-based applications, the processing time is 230 days. Next is work permit from inside Canada, initial and extension, it also varies by country, work permit outside Canada, for online applications, the processing time is 134 days, for paper-based applications, the processing time is 12 days. Next humanitarian and compassionate cases 22 months, next international experience Canada current season, the processing time is 56 days. That is over today in video thanks for watching entire video hopefully information useful to you see you later in next video.